action. One thing to know about me, I don't believe in mumble rap. And I purposely have not watched this video for quite some time because I didn't like the concept. But somebody on Patreon requested it. So we're here and I'm excited because have I been asleep? Who knows? Roll it. What up, everybody? Hold on. This is mad awkward because I don't know what I'm saying and I'm doing it live and I'm talking to y'all guys, but people are reacting live to me fuck up. So let's start over. At this time in 2019, I was not a fan of people calling rap mumble rap. Yes, mumble rap existed, but I think when I think of mumble rap and I think of like Young Thug bursting on the scene and all of that, to me, that's like 2015, 2016 time frame. I was way over and I've been over the mad mumble rap versus lyrical rap and death to mumble rap and all of those YouTube rapper type videos. I was like, enough already. Just, just fucking stop. We've, we've come out of the mumble rap experience and people on YouTube, YouTube rappers and their demographic, they were fucking holding tight to the mumble rap to style of like diss record and to me it was mad corny so anytime that i saw somebody say mumble rap i was like holy fuck i'm definitely not listening to this because it's corny to me but we done got sean matesky matt, matt sky Mattisky, one of those on Patreon who requested this. So I'm super excited, actually. I'm no longer in my hater mode because I was at an, at one point, but I feel like everybody has died down away from it and nobody's really talking about mumble rap so much anymore. So I'm super excited to see what this is about and what was happening in 2019. It's like a blast from the past. Follow your boy Instagram, Twitter, Discord. I'm recording this live, like I said, before I fucked up and uh we're doing this live so if you want to catch me recording reactions and you know react live with the community di not discord twitch is the best place to do it second link in the description sean here is a patreon requester so he, he, they get a guaranteed request by joining on patreon and if y'all guys want to support the channel you can get extra content requests exclusive content all that kind of thing over on patreon but other than that let's get it guys death to mumble rap or whatever the fuck. let's go No one's going to be able to unsee this once I point it out, but this lion's mouth looks like a capital D. Here we go. Know that I'm running the game, yeah. Purple is all in my veins, yeah. Copping a couple of chains, whoa. Throw it, I'm making it rain. Yo, how come everybody in the game wanna rap like you with the played out flow? I've been in the back, killing every damn track, and the rhymes all whack. How the fuck y'all blow? Well, this all right so what i gotta say again i'm not hating on vin j maybe i was hating on vin j back in the day and if i listened to this back in the day i would have had the same exact thought process that i'm about to say right now so y'all get ready y'all ready one two three go fast rap and mumble rap might as well be the exact same fucking thing don't even at me about it you know staccato ak-47 fast rap delivery same thing as mumble rap people use mumble rap as a crutch People use fast flow as a crutch. I've been in the back, killing every damn track, and the rhymes all whack. How the fuck y'all blow? Well, this shit is all that I know. Uh, rapping about bitches and clothes. Yeah, getting unlimited hoes. Whoa, all of my diamonds are Now nah, you rap with venom and then you pack the rhythm, and every track will hit him and you blow. But you whack a little bit, don't stack the syllables. You have to hit him with new flows. Like, nah, homie, I'm in it for. The ironic thing is that they both sound good, but they both sound very formulaic. But you whack a little bit, don't stack the syllables, you have to hit him with new flows. Like, nah, homie, I'm in it for cash, just wanna get me a bag, yeah, yeah. Tell him I whip in the jack, and I be popping them packs. Like, nah, everybody rap like that, everybody wanna make a track like that. Everybody else in the game sound the goddamn same, and you all kill a rap like that. Like, where the word play and the metaphors at? What y'all make, I can never call rap. Big L, big pawn, I'ma get them all back, and you mumbling motherfuckers to better fall back. Nah, homie. I mean, it's good, but you can't say that all of the mumble rap sounds the same when all of the fast flows sound the same, you know? Just because you're doing it at a more technically skilled level, if everybody raps fast, then nobody raps fast. You know what I'm saying? If everything causes cancer, then nothing causes cancer. I don't know what it is about YouTube rap audience that just fucking gravitates toward the fast paced flow. It's one of the main things that I don't like about YouTube rap is they feel that they have to rap like that. They feel like they have to have crazy internal rhyme schemes and word plays and metaphors. Why can't you just tell a story without having to rap fast? Back in the day, I will say mumble rap did exist. Like Young Thug, when he burst on the scene, to me, that was mumble rap. 
This right here is just auto tune rap. Nah, homie is not gonna change. Clearly we run in the game. Talk about women and change. Dropping the shit that be numbing your brain is fucking insane. And they love it. We ain't gotta rap and nothing. Long as they don't wait to bump in this end of fucking discussion. Yeah, maybe right now, but it's not gonna last. Y'all better make room for the profits of rap. When they hear real shit, no copying that. And then they all gonna see y'all rhyming as whack. Y'all snakes, I'm chopping the grass. Gonna hit them with a bang. No stopping the crash. Y'all wanna make bets. I'm dropping the cash. I'm not gonna let y'all kill hip hop in his tracks. But we ain't even kill it. It's evolved. Oh, fuck the ones who came before us. I'ma show them how to ball. It's not evolution. It's decent, uh, but this is exactly what I thought it was gonna be, and why I didn't watch it originally. It's just really cliche. It's really not. Pa I mean, I guess it is pandering. Um, it's pandering to the people that don't like this mumble rap style of rap. And in 2019, rap was far for hip hop was far from being dead. In 2019, hip hop was being re. It was fucking rising from the ashes of the phoenix. Lyrical rap had already started to make a comeback. We didn't need some someone to come in and say, hey, fuck mumble rap. The, the market was already doing that. It's an it's an easy way to get views on YouTube is to have this. This this fucking style, this song with this title and this style of fast rap, easiest way to get views on YouTube in terms of like YouTube rap connoisseurs and people who listen to YouTube rap. Right now, but it's not gonna last. Y'all better make room for the profits of rap. When they hear real shit, no copying that, and then they all gonna see y'all rhyming is whack. Y'all snakes, I'm chopping the grass. The profits of rap bar was whack. Profits of rap, when they hear real shit, no copying that, and then they all gonna see y'all rhyming is whack. Y'all snakes, I'm chopping the grass, gonna hit him with a bang, no stopping the crash. Y'all wanna make bets, I'm dropping the cash. I'm not gonna let y'all kill hip hop in his tracks. But we ain't even kill it, it's evolved. Fuck the ones who came before us, I'ma show them how to ball. It's not evolution, y'all better cool it. Fuck mumble rap, we need a better movement, more real shit than wait like. It's not evolution, y'all better cool it. You see, like if you're trying to fit the scheme, that's not a lyrical rap. Not evolution, y'all better cool it. I don't know. And what's the one guy going to do? You know, what's the one guy? Is he going to stop fucking mumble rapping his tracks like the person that stopped the fucking in Tiananmen Square where they're standing in front of the tank? You know, and I also will say the mumble side of this song, it's not a great it's it's too literal. There's way more nuance that goes into producing a mumble rap or Travis Scott style song where there's trap delivery and there's auto tune and there's all this ambiance, ambiance and there's a lot of like ad libs and shit going on in the background it's easy to say that mumble rap is shit when it sounds like the mumble rap portion of this song because it does sound like shit we ain't even kill it it's evolved fuck the ones who came before us i'ma show them how to ball yeah. it's not evolution y'all better cool it fuck mumble rap we need a better movement more real shit and way less pollution stop making music that's the best solution y'all think you dope but that's just delusion say you will but y'all don't ever prove it i'm the leader of the fucking revolution gonna get prepared for y'all execution everybody want to talk about the money and the women that they begin it but want to kill it when they rap everybody You know, it's it's there. It's just very cliche. That's what it comes down to. When I didn't watch this, I knew it was gonna be as cliche as it is right now. Everybody wanna talk about the money and the women that they begin it, but wanna kill them when they rap. Everybody wanna be the Mac of the game, but you rapping the same and I put them on the back. Everybody wanna be the best out, wanna find the best rap. Follow me and put them on the map. If you really wanna be the best in the game, stop rapping like everyone else on the track. Homie, that's all that they want. Bro, the triplet rhyme, the triplet flow at the end, the delivery right there, it's the same cliche delivery as the fast flow was. I feel like everybody, everybody saw what Eminem was doing. Everybody saw the hype that NF had, and then they tried to do the same thing, like on YouTube and put their own style and, and twist on it. Put them on the map. If you really want to be the best in the game, stop rapping like everyone else on the track. Homie, that's all that they want. Loving the money I flaunt. Yeah, yeah. Keeping it short. Don't gotta give it a thought. Only the shit that I bought. Fuck that. You gotta stay different. Y'all think it's happy. Y'all straight tripping. I'm off the chain of my place. Spinning y'all in the club with my paint dripping. I'm a fucking artist who's done with all this straight whack shit. So I'm busting on this. Y'all leaned out, but y'all suck regardless. I'm a run up on them. Feeling fucking lawless. Better tuck your chain and fucking run your wallets. You are now looking at the youngest prophet who be killing rappers. Got no other option. Yeah, they got green, but I'm a fucking goblin. Got green, but I'm a fucking goblin. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Not a fucking bar. There is nothing in here that's like, oh shit, okay, he's going ham. Literally, the only reason people are hyped about this track has got to be the delivery. It's got, it's got to be the really quick, quick spit. That's really it. Got green, but I'm a fucking goblin. Tell him whatever your man felt, say with the rhyme, so give me the black belt. Got flame and the vibes, I'm making the track melt. Going and to be fair, I'm not, I'm not talking shit. Or I guess I am talking shit about Vin J. I'm not like talking shit about him as a, as an artist. It could just be this one song. It could just be like. 
He's trying to force this fucking mumble rap versus lyricist narrative. And whenever you try to force that, it comes off as really corny and gimmicky. And you say things on the on the lyrical side that are that are very like corny. And then you say things on the mumble rap side, which are which are not fleshed out enough that, you know, it's just like a watered down version of both of these sides. He could be an amazing rapper, but this song right here isn't doing it. No lean dog, whatever the hint dealt like Hogo. Tell a bitch a flow so venomous, a bump bomb. Hit him with the stone cold evidence, a flow so relevant. A show no benefit, a low blow. Bring him with a popo, never been. Mumble rapper, shut your fucking mouth. Fall back, don't make another sound. Telling me to fucking dumb it down, but I'ma buck them all. I got a hundred rounds like bleh. Fuck it, I guess what I'm trying to say is that I miss the days when MCs were killing and blaze a track When flows were different and everybody would say some facts And I ain't saying I'm the best, just trying to save rap Everybody's trying to save rap, bro Why does everybody try to save rap? Alright, um... To say that was exactly what I thought it was gonna be Was gonna be, would be a huge, un, huge, huge understatement um so one to ten that's like a four for me this song right here has 18.3 million views why let's go through some of these comments here the people in these in this comment section are either are either past or in their m and m is the goat phase guys mumble rap bad fast rap good do you get it <laughs> i can tell he likes revival unironically <laughs> Imagine saying mumble rap unironically. Sixth grade me really thought this was real rap, huh? <laughs> Thank you for this amazing rap song. Before I was listening to the mumble raps instead of the true spherical lyrical individuals. Thank you for saving me from the mumble rap like Lil, like Lil Pump and then 500 praying hands. When two smart kids in the class get different <laughs> answers. You see, I'm not the only one that thinks like this. I'm glad. Okay, yo, that brings us to the end of this video, ladies and gentlemen. You like what you see, consider liking, leaving a comment down below. You like what you see enough, please consider subscribing. Also, if you want to support the channel, please consider doing so on Twitch. I am doing this right now live in front of about 90 people right now. They have their comments that don't make the, the don't make the video because this is specifically for you guys, but you can join in in the conversation while we're recording these live. If y'all guys want to get a guaranteed request in, do like this person did here who requested this do like Sean Maitsky and consider joining over on Patreon. You get a lot of early access content, extra content, playlists, all those kind of different things. But other than that, appreciate y'all's time. Go out there in the world. Love and care for one another. Love and care for each other. Catch everybody in the next video. Boom. Peace. Later.